Hi, my name is Lenore Michaelis. You may have heard my name in association with enzyme kinetics, specifically the Michaelis-Menten equation. I am a famous biochemist because of that equation. I want to introduce you to my colleague and associate Maud Menten. Hello, my name is Maud Menton. You might know me from the Michaelis Menton equation. Lots of people don't know that the Menton in the Michaelis Menton equation was, in fact, a female scientist. I hope that you're inspired by me, young ladies. Science is for all genders. Why, Maud, you got that right. Science is for all genders. And in fact, I value your contribution to the michaelis menten equation. I also understand that you went on to be very knowledgeable and successful in the area of histology. Boy, you were also a physician and a scientist from Canada. That makes you amazing. Why, Lenore Michaelis, you make me blush, but thank you for recognizing my contributions. It's true, I am from Canada, and I am a physician and a scientist, and I did know my way around a cell, hence my great contributions to histology. It makes me happy to think that all of the students in Dr. Charlier's class are going to get a chance to understand enzymes and my equation. It is indeed a great honor to serve Dr. Charlier's class with our equation. Enzymes are what make the world go round, and I love the Michaelis complex, the complex that takes place when an enzyme binds a substrate molecule to become the enzyme substrate complex, and then through the beauty of enz enzyme chemistry, product is made. Yes, indeed. I still will remember the day when we first discovered that the enzymatic rate is proportional to the concentration of the Michaelis complex. The complex formed when a substrate binds to an enzyme. The only regret I have is it isn't called the Menten complex. Why is it the Michaelis complex? Why, Maud, from the sounds of that last comment, I would say that you already have a complex. Just kidding. I'm not sure why they call it the Michaelis complex. You certainly had a big role in the development of this whole concept. I'm sorry. Can we still be friends? You're so kind, Lenora. Thank you so much for recognizing my... Great contributions. It seems a shame that sometimes I do feel a little jealous that you got the top billing on this. Oh well, that's okay. I'm confident that my contributions are really going to help Dr. Charlier's class understand enzyme kinetics. If they remember Chem 112 kinetics first, of course. And of course, we cannot forget my contributions to enzyme chemistry and kinetics, says Ben Franklin. Of course, you know the story about the time I flew the kite in order to, d to discover electricity. And when lightning struck the kite, I learned about the michaelis menten equation and told everything I learned to Lenore Michaelis and Maud Menten. So really, it should be the Ben Franklin equation. Why, shut your mouth, Ben Franklin, you total liar. Well, Ben Franklin, you're a total liar. I should wash your mouth out with soap, you little stinker. Hi, Dr. Brown here. Maybe you've seen me around at the Department of Chemistry, but I want to tell you that Ben Franklin is a filthy liar. He did not invent the michaelis menten equation. I'll bet my reputation as a bio-inorganic chemist and a UFO enthusiast. That's Eric Brown, PhD.
chemistry. This is Dr. Picklestein and I would not lie to you. It turns out that Ben Franklin is a filthy, filthy liar and you cannot trust him at all. He tried to take credit for the michaelis menten equation and I feel that that makes him a traitor to the United States of America and I hereby banish him. Hi, I'm a former student of Dr. Charlie. I took biochemistry with him and now after I got my chemistry degree in, in the spring of 2014, I find myself uh, taking up the job as Thor. Perhaps you've heard of me. Anyway, Ben Franklin's a jerk. I hate his guts. I'm going to go pound him on the head with a hammer after I travel back in time. Hello there. I am Henry Chalier's mother. Yes, I carried him in my parasite Woomba for nine months. And I've never known him to be this silly that he would have all of these people come before you and pretend to know something about the michaelis menten equation. It is true. Lenore Michaelis and Maud Menton, they were the... They did the equation, not Ben. Hi, I'm Henry Charlier's sister, Beth, and I want to tell you that Henry has lost his mind, and I need you to forgive him for it, but he still knows a fair amount about enzymes, and I could care less about enzymes, and I'd rather have a banana. Can you see the likeness between me and Henry? I'm his favorite sister. So I hope you now have an appreciation for enzyme kinetics and the role of Ben Franklin in the development of the michaelis menten equation. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, and don't forget, enzymes are really important and we're going to spend some time learning about the kinetics and then the chemistry of what they perform and how do they do kinetics.